we shot that video in the Simi Valley, just sort of north of LA, and, and we, we were on tour, and I think we were coming down the West Coast, and we had, I think we drove all night and woke up on our bus out in that field and walked off of the bus, and all those people were out there in the, in the costumes and everything, and we, it was just like, wow, we just walked in this surreal, I mean, it was yeah. like that. What, the video is, is sincere in that way, yeah. because we, we had, they had already shot the stuff with the girl running all over Los Angeles or wherever. We there for that. They did that the day before, and then we did the scene in the field, and, and it, was, it, was, it, was, it was extraordinary. And, uh, and then I, I remember at one point, Shannon was just completely naked walking around out there, and there were wild horses uh, that were out in those fields, and, and uh, it was a magical day. We were, uh, we were in an altered state, and uh, yeah, it, it, it looked... <laughs> When I saw the film, I was like, yep, that's how I saw it out of my eyes. Yeah. All the surrealism. Of it. Well, I mean, it changed everything over, overnight for us. You know, I heard you telling the story and I have the same story. You mm -hmm. know, MTV was so powerful at that time. Once we got into this thing called Buzz Bin, I think it was called. It just basically meant we're going to play the heck out of this video all day long. Yeah. And, you know, we, I remember playing at a place called Mississippi Nights, which is actually in St. Louis. And, uh, you know, it's, it's on the river. It's on the river. R right, right. Uh. I mean, the next day, once they started playing that video, it was like we were we were playing, you know, clubs, but the success happened what felt like overnight. So we're playing these small places, but more and more people are showing up. Everything sold out. It was almost, you know, at times it was kind of a little mayhem because we yeah, were playing. It got dangerous. It got there. dangerous because we were playing too small of places because the video just exploded and it just overnight it felt like everything was different. Yeah, I think. I mean, I think he did it for the same reason why I was keeping a journal, and I think he actually says it in the movie at some point. So much was happening to our to us, to our lives, things were happening at such a pace. I wanted to keep track of it because I couldn't keep track of it in the moment. So, no, I hated it. I kept a journal. That didn't bother anybody. I, w I didn't have somebody's, you know what I mean? I was writing about them, but they didn't know. I was a, a lot more secretive about it. So, no, the camera... You haven't seen those books. No, oh, no, you will. Oh, you will. You will. <laughs> but uh, anyway, the, no, the camera, the camera drove me crazy. I'm a very private person, so to have that thing in my face was was uh, maddening at t most of the time. But now I, I couldn't be more grateful. Mm -hmm.